guys good morning happy Thursday morning this is uh, the day right before Veterans Day and I'm going into work right now I've just stopped on the road uh, to shoot this video I am going to be wearing and testing the Rimmel BB cream it's not the matte one it's the nine-in-one beauty balm uh, it's just comes in three colors basically light medium and I believe a deeper shade uh, and I just got this kind of um, uh, urge to do this really from a little poet Susan who put up a video recently about her uh, wear test and how she liked the uh, Rimmel BB cream and she just loved it especially for mature gals so I had an older version. I had commented on her video about the version that I had and I didn't think much of it, honestly. It was a little too mattifying for my uh, skin type, but she assured me, she said that the new formulation, apparently they reformulated their product, Rimmel did, and uh, the new formula is working very well for the uh, older mature uh, skin community uh, gals. So with that, you know said and on her advice I went out and I purchased the Rimmel BB cream so I've got it in light I've got that on me now uh, I put on there and I'll put over here on the side the uh, stuff that I was using underneath that I did not use a primer I only put the soap and glory uh, something youth uh, skin youth something something cream it's a really really nice peachy smelly uh, type of day cream underneath it and it doesn't give too much oil underneath so it's just a wonderful cream to put underneath you know most of your foundations or makeup I did use a beauty blender throughout my face I did not do one side of a brush and the other on the beauty blender simply because I did not have time I kind of ran out of time and all of that um, it's a horrible rainy day I hope that you can see some some semblance of the makeup I'm gonna come in a little closer uh, just to show you guys everything it it went on really nicely I had no uh, problems putting it on it it almost had a dewy type of finish to it uh, definitely not a matte I did put on the soap and glory uh, matte uh, powder like a finishing powder and I I'll put it up here as well it's something blot something blah 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 I can't remember names guys so I'll put everything over here you know on the side here uh, but I used a little of that and I have the NARS orgasm uh, blush on very faint and I am trying on the new Rimmel shake it Sh fresh shake it fresh or something like that um, mascara apparently it's in this like a bottle looking thing and you're supposed to shake it before you apply it on your um, on your lashes I did two coats of that let me come in and show you guys that and I have you know skimpy lashes so I'm not I'm not the best for putting uh, mascara on right away I can tell that it is not as thick in formulation as the L'Oreal uh, Paradise um, L'Oreal uh, blah blah Paradise mascara I can't remember names this morning it's crazy uh, the fresh Paradise lash thing the one that's like uh, a dupe for I think the Too Faced or something um, I know that that gives a nice thick finish uh, I I went literally two coats on this on the bottom and the top and I can hardly tell I don't know if you guys can tell it's a nice deep uh, black uh, noir whatever they call it uh, but you know it it's good for an everyday mascara I wouldn't go whole hog with this mascara for you know glam night or going out on the town or anything like that but for going to work and you know just doing something with my skimpy lashes it's it's fine so anyway um, it's 8 10 uh, right now I'm looking at my dashboard I'll try to snap a picture of my dashboard before I leave here and uh, so 8 10 in the morning I applied this about a little after 7 a.m. this morning and like I said I'm on the road right now and I'll try to get back with you guys around uh, the lunchtime maybe a little after lunch to show you guys how this is wearing on my skin and then of course 
course at night. It's supposed to be a 24 hour hydration effect. Uh, I guess if you wear it 24 hours, I'm not understanding really if you wear it, but then you take it off before 24 hours, does it continue to hydrate your skin because of some of the creams in it? or? Or are you supposed to wear it for 24 hours and it will continually hydrate for 24 hours? So not really sure how that is all, you know, supposed to work. But um, so, yeah, right now um, I think it looks good. Let me look at my little mirror here on the side. Um, it's it's doing really good. Uh, it feels really good. It is not tacky at all. It dries down immediately, at least on my face. Um, and it's uh, it's soft. There's nothing rough on it. There's nothing tacky on it. Nothing is coming off at all, guys. There's no transfer right now that I can see. No oil buildup right now. Again, it's only been on about, you know, an hour. Yeah, so I'm not, I'm not, I mean, if it were already doing that, that would be pretty lousy of a makeup if it were already, you know, giving me a hard time after an hour. But like I said, I'll check in with you guys later on today, heading to work. It is rainy. Blah, I hate it, but, um, and it's getting cold here too. So I'm, I'm hoping that Thanksgiving will be a better day out than it is today because mm, not good, not good. All right. I love you guys. I'll see you in a bit. Bye. Hey guys, I hope you can hear me. It's a little loud back here because it's kind of industrial and everything. I'm just sitting outside here. Um, so it's about 1.30 uh, p.m. So I'm gonna give you a little update on how the skin is doing. Uh, so far so good. I've gotten rid of my lipstick as you can see because I've been having lunch and snacking out and everything. But um, I really like the makeup, you know guys? It's not doing badly at all. I'm kind of looking at myself here in the viewfinder um, and I'm seeing, you know, I, I do have a little bit of oil on the forehead, but that's like a normal thing for me. I always, you know, it breaks through no matter what. I, Unless I am going to blot or unless I'm going to put the powder on, it's going to, you know, come through. So that's, you know, that's neither here nor there for me. Um, but it's it's having a nice little coverage. It's not a full coverage, obviously. It's very uh, liquid coming out of the tube, so it's not going to give you guys a full coverage. But um, you know, for a casual Friday or for a weekend um, run around, you know, around town just to get stuff, um, I'm really pleased with it. I don't feel it uh, tacky at all. I don't feel. I think my blush has still uh, stayed down pretty well. So that's a good thing. Um, and overall, you know, I'm, I'm going to give it a, a thumbs up so far. You know, it's, it's doing good. And uh, what else? I'll just, uh, I'll check in with you guys, you know, later in the afternoon um, once I start to get home and uh, run my errands around town. I'll go ahead and post one more time inside of the car so you guys can see. And, um, you know, it's, like I said, it's not probably, I'm not saying it's going to last, you know, 24 hours. I doubt that it's going to last 24 hours, but right now it is sticking uh, to my, uh, you know, face. And, um, from what I've been using, I did use my phone one time. I didn't see a major transfer on my phone at all. I know I can't show you because I'm actually talking to you guys from my iPhone. I'm, you know, uh, videotaping this. So it's not like I can, you know, turn around and show you guys. But, uh, you know, it really has not been an issue as far as that's concerned. Is there some transfer? Probably, but nothing where it was an oil slick or anything. Anyway, do you hear these noises there? It's just crazy. Uh, how much sounds there are around here. Like I said, it's really industrial around here, so um, you know, bear with me with a lot of trucks coming in and out. Anyway, I'll check in with you guys in a bit, so stay tuned and I'll see you shortly. Bye! Hey guys, this is it. It's about uh, 5.15 now. I took a picture of the uh, car phone, uh, car 
o'clock. Listen to me. I'm so tired. I can't even talk. Seriously. Um, so I've, you know, lost the lipstick. So forget the lipstick. But, um, you know, I am actually pleasantly surprised. Uh, I have not had any breakthrough real, you know, shine or anything. I'm looking at my skin. It looks really good. Um, I do have some of the remainder blush left, very small amounts, but it has, you know, held on to the, to the foundation below. So that's kind of like a plus, you know, that it is hanging on. Um, and I don't see any really major, um, oils or anything on my on my forehead at all in fact it's pretty matte i know i don't know if the camera's picking it up but i was looking at myself earlier in the uh car uh you know what do you call that mirror and i didn't see any significant you know oil damage or anything on there it's been really holding up very nicely i really am surprised with this guys i really am um it's you know it's covering very nicely there's no chalkiness there's no access excessive oil or anything on it so I'm thinking this is a definitely a keeper this is something I'm gonna be uh, going ahead with and um, using and definitely for a you know kind of like um a Friday type of day like I said this is not for a big glam out type of uh, um, foundation it's not for going to you know the theater or the Oscars or anything like that it's not gonna hold up I've had it on for like uh, what like eight or nine hours now so it's been pretty good um, I have the street lights shining on me actually coming in now so uh, they just turned on here in the parking lot so let me get closer to the camera so you guys can see it with the um, you know with the light shining on there that's kind of cool that there's you know in enough light here on the street where you can really see um you know uh, the the glow uh you know of my skin and everything and uh like i said even if you look at my forehead here there's not any excessive uh oil or anything uh, building up so i think this uh makeup has held up really nicely even under my eyes i know i look kind of uh haggard from you know eight nine days of work uh, eight nine days listen to me i can't talk anymore eight nine hours worth of work uh at the office so um yeah i think it's held up really really nicely if i were going out well i am going out tonight for dinner but just with hubby nothing you know just very casual i'll just slap some lipstick on the pig and uh call it a day and uh maybe i'll put a little bit of eyeshadow on uh just just because and then um i'll blot down and put on a little maybe fresh uh blush and that'll be it you know for me for tonight um probably not even going to change my outfit or anything guys i'm in jeans so i don't care um so anyway this will be the last check-in for you guys i hope you enjoyed this video please give it a thumbs up if you did um having thumbs up uh, in my videos you know helps them rank higher on youtube so more people can view it the more people that see it more people view it and of course subscribe if you haven't i'd love to have you here as part of the community we are all mature uh ladies for the most part there are some gentlemen of course that watch my videos and that's perfectly fine um, because I do give a lot of uh, t excuse me tips on health and um, you know food and cooking and things like that so there's a number of different um, you know people on here for all reasons uh, you know watching my videos so that's great I'd love to have all of you here as many of you as want to come on board and uh, I do put up videos about twice a week you know right now so that's going good so that's it guys um hopefully you saw enough of this and my face and everything and i hope you have a wonderful weekend it is thursday but it's getting on veterans day i know it'll be past that once i put this video up but anyway just to let you know the time sequence and uh, have a great weekend if you are uh watching this uh on a friday or anything and blessings to everybody Thanksgiving is coming up, so I hope that you are making plans to be with your family and have some wonderful times and make some wonderful memories because that's what it's all about. I love you all. See you later. Bye-bye.